What's going on YouTube? GSNOTA here. Today we have some great news for those of you on iOS 11.3 waiting for a jailbreak and also for the iOS 10.3.3, 10.3.2, 10.3.1 and lowered users running on an iPhone 7 or 7 Plus. Yes, I'm talking Meridian here. I'm going to start though with the fact that the vulnerability for the iOS 11.3 might be released publicly after all. Remember I made a video about the vulnerability that means Spark Zeng actually discovered after the iOS 11.3 was published by Apple and he said in here, quote, good, a zero day bug survived in the iOS 11.3 update. Well, a couple days ago he also said, Quote, we've submitted a talk about these vulnerabilities and exploit techniques to a conference. If the talk is accepted, we will help Apple to fix these problems and disclose the detail of the vulnerabilities. So we might get a full disclosure of this kernel vulnerabilities and they're actually very powerful. He was able to pretty much pound the kernel. He was able to pretty much create a couple crashes in here on iOS 11.3, which normally should have patched quite a lot of bugs because if you take a look on the um, you know the list of vulnerabilities that have been patched in iOS 11.3 you wouldn't believe there are vulnerabilities in there anymore but apparently there are and they're quite powerful and there are also kernel vulnerabilities which do help the jailbreaking. Anyways moving swiftly on we're going to get into the Meridian. Yes it's been a while since we heard anything about the Meridian but Sparky the developer of the Meridian jailbreak for the iPhone 7 and 7 Plus on iOS 10.x said, quote, an errorless Cydia is the best Cydia. And he posted a picture of Cydia managing to install something completely fine with no errors, which is definitely dope, especially considering that Meridian has been in the works for quite a while now and it's really, really time to get this jailbreak done and to have it shine. The uh, next picture he posted is this one with uh, the Cydia showing all the packages that have been installed, amongst which are a couple Meridian related packages like the safe mode, substitute, um, there is the uh, Cydia modifier, there is the lib jailbreak and so on. So there are a lot of things that are being done currently. If you take a look here on the Trello page for the, the current development of the Meridian jailbreak, most of the important things are marked as completed, including the safe mode, uh, including the uh, substitute parts, the midnight packages and so on. There are still a lot of things to do, but these are very important and since he got the uh, Cydia to properly install things without erroring out, this is already a huge step. So yes, a lot of things are going on in the jailbreak community and with the Meridian being close to be complete, we should expect a release in the near future, if anything goes well. And speaking about the iOS 11.3, what this means? Well, since there are kernel vulnerabilities that this security researcher MinSpark Zinc has, and since he is willing to pretty much publish them on a conference and publicly disclose them, this might help quite a lot the jailbreaking process, since this would make iOS 11.3, which is currently signed, also vulnerable and also pawnable, which is definitely very, very useful. However, I still do not recommend updating to 11.3 for the moment. I still recommend it to stay on iOS 11.2.6 or lower since there are already released vulnerabilities for this range, 11.2 up to iOS 11.2.6. But if you already updated to 11.3, it's now unfortunately too late to go back since Apple is no longer signing the 11.2.6. But as you can see, the situation is not that dire since this dude is willing to publish his research and this will help a lot the jailbreaking. And that's pretty much the news for today guys, thank you for watching, do not forget to subscribe to stay updated and tell me in the comment section down below what do you think about this whole situation, do you think we should expect the Meridian jailbreak to be released soon? Thank you for watching, I'm Geosnow, peace out.